guys and welcome back to the channel so really quick and this is going to be a walmart haul i went to i actually went to walmart today and i ordered some stuff and i went to i was going to go to self-checkout but they were honestly packed on self-checkout so i went to the cashier checkout um and i don't know you know this lady had a uh, she had a whole attitude and she was like bagging and I, I could see this from like two people ahead of me that she was bagging items and one of the ladies she spoke and said something to her and she said I'm just having a really bad day blah 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 you know I'm really not trying to be in her drama um and I'm really not trying to listen to all the negativity she got coming out of her mouth but she was having a bad day just put it all in so just one she was having a bad day I don't know if it was before she came to work something before she came to work something after she came to work but she was having a really 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 bad day because I'm gonna show you how she was having a bad day. Where is that bag? She was having a huge, like a like an emotional bad day because she put one thing. She wasted a bag pretty much, and she put one thing of great value vanilla pudding mix inside of this big bag. And she could have been putting something else in, and it, I found a couple of more things that she put one item in. Like she put this thing of rice right here in, in a bag by itself like I, I oh, yes all I told her when I got ready to leave I asked her well before we we it made eye contact I asked her how she was doing she went you know she went on she was like oh I'm doing okay and I told her you know I stopped her I just told her I said you know what well, whatever your problem is honey you need to stop you need to regroup you need to go to the bathroom and you need to pray and then you need to come back and <laughs> Because I'm for sure you probably don't want to leave work. So you need to come back and just try it again. Because it is nothing in this world that's that bad. <laughs> unless you're losing, unless you lose someone. If there's nothing, there's nothing in this world that's that bad. That, you know, um, you have to treat a customer. Especially in that job field at Walmart. And you have all these different customers and stuff like that. Um... There, it, there's nothing like me personally I work with customer service all day I, I work in the food industry all day each customer that comes up to me honey they are always leaving big time compliments on me because if I'm like one person if if she ever have a bad day we can never tell because she's always smiling she's always giddy she's always respectful like she always treat us with respect and, and tell us to have a good day and then in return they always tell me you have a great day. Like, you tell us all the time to have a great day. No, no, no. You have a great day. Because we don't have often tell you guys to have a great day. And we take you guys for granted. And I understand it. And, and work feels like this, you know. When at the end of the day, like, this is your job. <laughs> you know, if you can't handle the pressure, you know. Like I tell my employees, because I am a manager at my job. Um, if you can't handle the pressure, maybe this is not for you. It's not for you. And I always tell my employees, don't bring anything from the outside into this building because we are not having that. No, no. But anyways, you guys, we're going to get into this haul. But I just wanted to let y'all know that my cashier, she had the worstest time. Maybe y'all can pray for. I've already prayed for. And um, yes, yes. <laughs> so all these bags, <laughs> all these bags. So girl, I, look, sis, bruh. I want, look at this look at all these bags i want um and this is from the delivery from the other day but this from today it's way bigger than that delivery one but um i won't have to go to the store and buy those little trash bags for the upstairs bathroom never again <laughs> i'm gonna use those bags for my trash can upstairs but what i got from walmart today um i got this five pound bag of yellow uh potatoes i got some crescent rolls I got some great value whipped topping. I got bell peppers, two of them. I got some Southern style O'Brien um, hash browns with onions and peppers. Um, I can't never find these, but I was really glad that they had them on hand today. So I'm really excited. So when I do make breakfast, we can have some of these. They're so good, you guys. Then I got some great value Mar uh, mozzarella cheese. Um, I got some El Mexicano nacho cheese. We fell in love with this cheese right here. This is really, really good, you guys, and it's way cheaper than the original. 
uh, Rico's cheese. Um, so I'm glad we made that switch. I got two things of Roman tomato because they're so cheap. Um, then I got some more pepperonis. Then I got some John Merle smoked sausages. Um, and then I got some uh, banquet brown and serve turkey sausage. You get 10 links in each box. So I got turkey ones and then I got the original which has the pork and turkey in it. Um, these are for babe and uh, these are for me. Now we're going to have this for our uh, um jambalaya. So I'm going to eat some of that but not a lot. Um, I normally try to make my uh, like whenever I do the Xanarae's jambalaya, I try to keep like for myself just a little portion of meat in there But the rest just rice Because um, I really don't like to eat pork at all But this has chicken and pork in it Which I means still, you know, if it was chicken it would be great um, They didn't have turkey kind of this So I had to get this one and it's way cheaper than our regular Decker um, sausages and then I come into contact with these off of YouTube this lady she does like these five dollar meals and that's how I started just buying all this stuff and it was way cheaper than what I normally would pay for anything at Walmart so my budget for my groceries is six dollars I only went over today nine dollars so I'm doing pretty well like kudos to me I'm doing good I just went over nine dollars which is okay and I'll put that back um, um, probably tomorrow the nine dollars that I went over I'll put it back in the grocery um, uh, in the grocery section in my binder in my budget binder um, in the envelope so these right here she said that these were really good and the fact that they have the ground beef and they have ground turkey so she said that when you whenever like if you shopping online at walmart the door and the delivery you have to just kind of look for these um and sometimes they're like at the bottom of the screen so you just have to keep scrolling and scrolling until you see it these are the festive ground turkey um little tubes here it says 85% lean, 15% fat, and these are the ground turkey ones. So I got two, two. Oh, I got three of these. They were two dollars and some change each. So two, four, six, plus tax seven dollars. Um, so I'm gonna start getting these because these are gonna keep my refrigerator room like it's gonna make a lot of room and a lot of difference in my freezer. Cause look at that, you guys. I try to organize my freezer all the time. And it just gets back right messy. So, um, but before we eat these, we're going to eat the other meat that's in there as well. Um, I did get some parsley. They didn't have any of the regular parsley that I normally get. Fresh parsley. So, I opt to get these curly ones. Uh, the curly leaf parsley, which I never knew they had. I was always passing it up. <laughs> and it was sitting right there in my face. But I always try to get the other curly, uh, the other regular parsley. But... We're going to try this one this time. Um, over here in the dry section, because this is our fridge, and this is like our dry cabinet stuff that we put in the cabinet. So we got some ramen noodle soup chicken flavor, the packs, because most of the time when I order online delivery, they always say that they don't never have it. So when I go to the store, next time I go to the store, I'm going to uh, video me getting this stuff with the prices and stuff, and then show you guys that they have a whole aisle and a whole little section full of ramen noodles. And I don't understand how, why they say they're always like out of it or got substituted. And I got um, one of these. Then I got some of these Great Value Navy beans. Because um, it's going to go with a meal for not next week but for the following week. And then I have these uh, chili beans. No start added. So you can add your own seasoning to them. Um, so I got two of those as well, and these are all great value brand, so Walmart brand. Then I love me some Martha White Wild Berry Muffin Mix. Like my mama, she used to always make these, and I just I I miss my mom's breakfast since I, you know, moved and been on my own for a minute. Um, but I miss my mom's breakfast, and I can't never catch it because I'm always working. So I got two packs of these Martha White uh, Wild Berry uh, Muffin Mixes. And then 
again mom always make that jiffy cornbread and she normally make it homemade too as well but she not addressed the jiffy cornbread up too as well but um i got two of those because they're way cheaper than the regular like the regular cornbread that i was getting like crusties is two dollars this i think was like 60 cents and then i think they have some like uh they have the texas brand i tasted that and i wasn't too hot about it um and then they have some other kind i think martha white too as well that are just some scents like um they're cheap and you guys just go ahead and laugh because your girl got a great value uh complete pancake and waffle mix buttermilk one and then i got another uh pancake mix which i sh like i was trying to um put back but the line was the line behind me was like crazy and i just didn't want to sit it up on the cab on the counter because i mean you don't want to make somebody's day even worse by putting your stuff that you don't want up on the um the little thing at the register so i just wound up keeping it and so i got the hungry drag buttermilk uh pancake and waffle mix the same thing as this one if i go back to walmart i'll definitely um exchange this for something else um if we still have it because we do have i try to stick stay on our pancake mix but if you see we do have some of the uh, miss miller um pearl milling um pancake mix as well up there we almost out of that so that's why i got more but honestly i wasn't trying to get two of them i was just trying to get the great value brand because it tastes the same as any other and then i got um what is this Babe was talking about he wanted some of the red velvet cake. So I, ooh, ooh, oh my gosh, I got the red velvet cake. Yes, I did. But upon getting this real velvet cake, you guys, like I was in the icing department. I don't really know what happened, but I just never did grab the icing. And I was trying to look for the cream cheese icing. They did have great value brand cream cheese icing, but I was like, I don't know that one. I've never had it. I've never tried it. And I'm not sure if it'll be good on this cake. So I went to go look for Duncan Hines and they didn't have no cream cheese icing. That's about the only ice I'm going to eat. Um, and so um, that's what really makes the cake, the cream cheese icing. And I mean, I'm just sitting there looking for the cream cheese icing and I could, girl, I could have just looked online and seen how to make the actual real cream cheese icing. <laughs> Um, but, um, until next time I go back, I'll get some icing or I'll probably stop at the store sometime this weekend and grab some staples that I missed. Um, I did get the Zenerade's, um, uh, one pot jambalaya reduced sodium, um, meal. This is a 30 minute meal. Just add the meat and you're good. So you can add the sausage, you can add chicken, um, you can add whatever kind of meat you like in there. Um, ground beef ground turkey and just jazz it up the way you like I did get some other great value vanilla instant pudding pie mix I use this for banana pudding minus the bananas y'all already know how we do it around here because <laughs> I don't get down with no bananas <laughs> um, unless it's in a smoothie then we can talk <laughs> but um, I got the Mahanma uh, seasoned yellow rice I love this rice right here I come to love this rice from Boston Market restaurant they always have this rice on deck on hand and i used to eat boston market a lot and that's why i started buying this rice right here it feeds two people so if it's more than two people you have definitely have to get like maybe two or three packs but this was a sits as well it wasn't even a dollar so um i did get some great value vanilla wafers for the vanilla pudding um then i got babe some of these honey barbecue corn chips we've never tried this um, so I, I'm really excited to see what he thinks of these. Um, but anyways, you guys, that is all we have for our uh, Walmart haul. Remember, again, I did not do a delivery today. I just went there because I'm just kind of over the whole delivery process thing and just paying all that money and stuff like that. Now, today I could have saved uh, by getting my groceries delivered, but I just wanted to get out the house and just kind of, you know have some more time you know um but anyways you guys if you like the video and you made it this far definitely go ahead and subscribe um and i will definitely see you in the next video bye you guys